ballpark genetically will be able to come and go as they see fit. Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play Bioshock Remastered with your host, Circuit Cultist, here. When last we left off, that happened. There was also a lot of alcohol. Also, we proved that we don't need guns in this game. Because who needs guns when you can zap people with lightning, set them on fire, and... Uh, what else was it? Ah, yeah. Make them really angry and then fling their own stuff at them. You look cozy. Anyway, we were trying to, uh, I, I don't know, help Atlas's uh, family escape Rapture for some reason. I don't know. I think. Hang on. Whoops. Completely forgot. Got to take snapshots. Action shot. Yeah. What bonuses do we have here? Okay, we have those bonuses. Uh, and we got, we've got the power. We we can just hack this. Finally found that audio log I was looking for. Turns out it was on the corpse, which really explains why I couldn't find it in the first place. I completely forgot about that. Some of these uh, audio logs are actually on corpses instead of sitting out in the open. By the way, I, I think as far as uh, turrets go, this is like one that will never ever be used. Yeah. We all come down here. Figured we all be part of up in Fort Frolic banging fashion models. <sighs> We're down in this dump yanking guts out of fish. Hey, yeah, everybody's got to scrub toilets, man. He's like uh, one of us, you know? Like he's worked a day in his life. Yeah, he says meet him at his fish packing joint at 11. I'll go. Bring a couple of guns. Hit the switch up there in the control. Oh! Hey! It's the bathosphere! Well, you mean as opposed to all the times you tried sending people after me with... Oh, well, that looks ominous. Anyway, all the times you tried sending people after me with uh, pheromones and bribes and money and stuff. Because, I mean, I'm not entirely sure what in the world you could possibly do to me. I mean, if we're gonna be honest, I I've already proven that you, even if you take away my guns, you know, uh, I can still pretty much kill you. I'm just saying. Hmm. Well, it glows, therefore we must press it. Oh, glowing lever. Tell me about your plot threshold. Hmm, that can't be good. Are you sure anyone's even in there? Maybe. of them. They die to cameras. Wow. You must be pretty strong. Well, I 
I'd say now is the perfect time for a photo opportunity. Oh, sweet. Mid flip. That's right, smile for the camera. You know, this lady, if you could just, uh, hang on, hang on, let me, uh, I know you're busy trying to kill me, but right quick, let me play this pipe drink game. It's super important. Life. You know, all this hell going on, but then you're, you're like, hang on, hang on, I need to hack this, it, it's very important. And they're like, yeah, sure thing, why not? I'll just hover here midair, you know, while you kind of do your thing, and I really, really appreciate that. Okay. Thank you! Did you have anything important? Yes, you did. Why? I'm winning. Did we get maximum damage? Hey! Spider splicers are now fully researched. That is amazing. That said, you are now dead. Eh. Priorities. I wonder if he'll need me as that kind of friend. Fontaine, I know you're dead, but you wouldn't happen to have any after-death offers, would you? Okay, I think that's all the stuff we can loot. Okay, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I was totally trying to rescue Antlis's family from, uh... I don't know. Splicers? Maybe? There's no blood smear, so... I don't know. Maybe it just got really, really confused and it was the wrong one. Also, I like how it says corpse. Alright, I completed the uh, spider research. Okay. Let's see, that leaves thuggish. Bouncers, Rosies, and a little something extra. Hmm. What do you have to say? The Irish pork pie offered me a deal. I flip him Fontaine and I 
walk out of here. That simple. How do I know that fat fuck isn't Fontaine's guy? How do I know they're not all Fontaine's guy? Fontaine's got Adam, and everybody wants it. Ryan's got a whole lot of talk and a nice suit. Even down here, any idiot can see which way the wind is blowing. That's a very unusual effect here on the water. I wonder. I know I... Whoop, nope. I know I turned it off, but, uh... Let's see, let's try real-time reflections. Okay, nope, nope, that's not part of the reflections. I wonder what that fog effect is. That's weird. Soon, I shall complete my dream of being a goldfish. Time to head to Arcadia. After this loading screen. Use it as a med kit. I came to this place to build the impossible. You came to rob what you could never build. A hum, gaping at the gates of Rome. Beefy. Even the air you breathe is sponged from my account. Well, be deep. So later you might remember the taste. You get to the bathosphere in the Roland Hills. That'll take you straight to the devil himself. And then all debts will be paid in full. Hold up, hold up. Wasn't that something that I had to set something on fire with? Yeah. I could have sworn I, I was supposed to set this on fire and then it would open up. Weird. Liquid nitrogen, I wonder what that could be for. Glue. Shell casings and batteries. Kerosene. Money. Okay. Proximity mines were full on those. Nice. Oh, there's no seaweed here. That's weird. Hmm. That's actually incredibly weird now that I think about it, because, I mean, Arcadia would be one of the most few things would be surrounded with it. Up for our shotgun. Gas tube. Cameras. Seems like some poor blighters have started seeing ghosts. <laughs> ghosts? Ryan tells me it's a side effect of this plasmid disease. One poor sod's memory is getting passed on to another through genetic sampling. Lunatics, rebellion, and now bleeding ghosts. Hey, life in Ratchet Rat. Yes, yes, somebody is here. Ooh. The augmentation procedure is a success. The slugs alone could 
not provide enough atom for serious work, but combined with the host, now we have something. The slug is embedded in the lining of the host's stomach, and after the host feeds, we induce regurgitation. And then we have 20, 30 times yield of usable atom. The problem now is the shortage of hosts. Fontaine says patience, Thunderbow. Soon, the first home for little sisters will open, and that problem will be solved. Well, that doesn't sound sinister at all. I got lined up. Everything's ready. Flowers, bottle of wine, even two tickets to the tea garden. Nothing gets the Bettys in the mood like nighttime in Arcadia. Now I just gotta stop by the thrifty care to pick up a med hypo. Just to be safe. Worthy Hello, sir. Missing Angelina's first visit to the tea garden. Hey, got him. I mean, come on. I know this game. I know I can take a photo off here. Yes, in fact, I'm kind of wondering if you could also help me out by showing me some grenades. Okay, there's nothing in there. Wait, I saw, I saw a thing. There was a thing I could pick up. Okay, well, at the very least, I got med hypo. Well, I say med hypo, but, uh, what I really... Hey, over here! time either. Although it did kind of freak me out with the uh, mask. Like, him appearing behind me didn't take me by surprise at all. But yeah, the, the weird mask thing and then him